All right, man. I appreciate you, man. Billy Don, man. Yeah. You're the best. You're the best. Hey, yeah. if you're not already subscribing, subscribe to his channel. This guy's the best. He's the truth. He's the real. Subscribe and hit that like button. Grinds hard. Thank you. Hey, did you feel? Did, were you the one that filmed that lady doing the nets? Yeah, that was me. I saw that on Facebook. That, yeah, that was me. That was that's gotten so many hits. I know I got a lot of hits. My captain went today. I heard to be able to mend our net. Oh yeah. Good publicity. Oh thanks, man. Yeah. What's up, my friend? How are you? Good. Say something. <laughs> Shy. Oh okay. <laughs> Where the hell did he go? Where the hell did he go? Oh, he's over there. I'm right here. What's up? How you guys doing? Yeah. Hey. On YouTube, anybody want to say anything on behalf of Cordova Nightlife? Welcome Happy to Friday. Cordova. Uh, <laughs> open mic night. Open mic night on a Friday night. And it's not even night. <laughs> Wait till 12. It won't be night then either. Is he, he's mad at somebody? He's mad at somebody. Yeah. What's up guys, how you doing today? This is Philly Dom. This is my last day in Cordova, Alaska. It's all over. It's all over. My last day in Cordova, Alaska. My final day, it's all over. I'm gonna walk around the harbor just a little bit. Let you guys see the harbor, let you see the, the beauty of Cordova, Alaska. Cause it's a, definitely a beautiful place. Definitely a beautiful place worth coming to visit, worth coming to check out. So just walk with me for a little bit. We're gonna walk through the boat harbor, Cordova Boat Harbor. Man, it was a rough season. Had his ups and his downs. Made a little bit of money. I don't know what's next. I should be traveling pretty soon. Or I might take another assignment because they offered me some other assignment. A quick assignment, maybe like a month, month and a half assignment. So I'm not sure quite yet. Or just get on the road and start traveling to the different countries. I'm still deciding. So I'm gonna have to make a decision pretty soon. Well, this is the Dover, Alaska Boat Harbor. You've seen it in a couple of my videos. You saw this place in a couple of my videos. Philly Dom. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm Zoya. Nice to meet you, Zoya. Uh, we saw you walking down here. We figured we'd give you an interview and ask you about San Diego. I know you're not from San Diego. I'm not. But yeah. you're here visiting. I am. Yep, yep. What do you think of uh, this area right here? Canada. Oh my God. What do you I think, think of this area? This area is beautiful. I mean, just the, I just was taking a stroll. Um, I'm attending a conference right here at the hotel and I just decided to take a stroll down and I mean, it was beautiful and I just really, um, I'm mean, just enjoying the people and the view and it's so relaxing. Like I live in a big city, so it's, I like it. You like the show, yeah, yeah. Uh, and they have the beautiful beach atmosphere. Yeah. Well, you, so you'll definitely come back to San Diego. Oh, completely. I think I definitely want to take a, uh, like, a like a weekend day trip or something or okay. um, yeah, some, some, something in the near future, hopefully. Okay. Yeah. And you're, on, you're literally on the best place right here. They have the military, they have a bunch of nice restaurants. It's probably the most expensive place to live in in San Diego. Oh, Me gusta, what is it? Me gusta the Playa del Carmen. So you what you is a visa? You guys get a visa to come here or a visa up? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah, we have a visa from tourists. Okay. From six months. Oh, so when your visa up you leave. Won't you just go to like Belize or Guatemala for like a day? Yeah, maybe. And to get it stamped. Also to Cuba, but Cuba too. Get it stamped and come back. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. You were like in school, like you you got 
you were like a student or something like that at home? There in, in Buenos Aires? Yeah. Okay, no, I was working in American Express and I, um, I was oh. studying music. Oh, okay, what kind of instrument? Theater music. What type of music? No, I, I made theater music. Oh, theater, theater, theater music. Theater music. Your yeah, English is good too. I gotta get my no, Spanish. No, it's not. I mean, it's good I enough. Every, my English is only from here. Once you get better and better. I really don't better. know. <laughs> you get better and better being at the desk. Oh, no. okay, that's all. Wait, okay. you have a YouTube channel? Yeah. I I'm, need to see that. Yeah, I'm interviewing you. I'm gonna let you see it. Okay, wait, what's your? It's Philly Dom. I need to Google it. Yeah. Let me take off this stupid Kanye West book bag that I always have on. Wait. You're gonna be famous now. Oh my god. It ain't that many. Oh my god. Wait, Dominique. Yeah. Dominique. And yeah, yeah. what's Oh Philly Dom. P H let me write it down. Let me write no, it wait. down. P-H? Yeah, P H I I L L Y. Philly. Philly Dom. Philip Dom. It's a new channel. Dominic Phillips. And you no. see me standing up like this? Like this? Yeah, this would be me. With the purple shirt on. Come no, in, let me come, come over, I'll come over. Come on over. Uh oh, you can sing? Wait. <laughs> what? Oh, you put my real oh you almost like almost like real government. Ah, Did you read all that? Okay, I'll wait. help you out. So So you put P Wait. Phil. Lee. Ah, okay. That's me right there. Philly. Yeah. No, it's not. Wait. It went back to the old one. That's why. That's not. Philly Dom. D O M. Ah, okay. That's it. That's, That's it. it. This oh, is yeah, me. Man. This oh, is yeah, me. man. <laughs> this is me. And these are my videos. Your videos. Yeah. Cool. Oh, Mamitas. Me. Playa del Carmen. Yeah, that's Playa, nice. Playa Carmen Vivo. Yeah. I gotta... Okay. I, I need to see what kind of videos are there. That's just travel blogger. I'm a travel blogger. Yeah. So wherever and, I go. And you don't have Instagram. Yeah, I have Instagram. You want it? Maybe, yeah, maybe. But Instagram is easier, you know? Maybe okay. You have more audience. But Instagram. Yeah, my Instagram is I am. I am. Yeah, I A M, then underscore. Yeah. Underscore uh, Philly Dom. Yeah, but I have to. I was trying to do something with my Instagram, and people think I'm crazy. Like, um, they said that my yeah, uh, and yourself. Yeah, they said that on my Instagram that my my Instagram was. Uh, my, I need to step up my picture quality, but I was trying to give it like a rugged, old school feel. But I guess that's not working. Okay. Yeah, people would tell. Like, look at if you look at the pictures. Yeah, that's me. I'm here. See how they fade it. I was trying to do something different, but it doesn't work. I guess. But wait, you are here. These videos are from traveling. Yes. Okay, you need to follow follow people so they fo they they are following back. Okay, I want I want half of Argentina to uh, follow me. Yeah. Yeah. I follow you. Look. Yeah, you did. Let me see. Oh yeah, you did. You're eight hundred and seventy, eight hundred and seventy six, and I had eight hundred and seventy five. That's that's true. No, seventy seven. 77. I can't read now. I'm blind. Yeah, you're right. 876. Okay. I had a lot more, and then I had to work. I worked in Alaska. You worked in Alaska? Yeah, in, in the fishing industry. Oh, my God. I told you something. You'll probably laugh so hard. I've been living in Mexico. I have a place in Mexico. Yeah. In Tijuana. I've been living in Tijuana, Mexico, probably like eight years, eight to ten years. I got to add it up. Like about maybe eight and a half years or ocho, ocho, ocho annual, ocho annual. Or Ocho Nuevi, or Ocho Annual. You were in Argentina? Never, but I'm going, I'm going. You need to go. Okay. They say I look like um, Carl Cox. Do you feel dominant? Yeah, you did an interview. You didn't even know you did an interview. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, thank you I so much. Know. Thank you. We'll see you yeah. in Argentina. Yeah, I will, I will come down there. Cool. Well, you got my Instagram, so we should stay I friends. I have your Instagram. Yep. Yeah, we'll stay friends on Instagram. Just leave me a message like Philly Dom or what's okay. up. Okay, what? Well. Yeah. They say what's up? No, what's up? In the states is like a slang term. I was like, how you doing? Yeah, or, yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, how, how, what's up, yeah, man? Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, I speak because I'm from Philadelphia, so we speak like a different cadence or a different dialect. I am. Uh, no, I am from. Uh, yeah, you, you guys speak a. You guys sound like you're speaking uh, Italian, but it's Spanish. Your, your Spanish sounds like it has like a, a Italian cadence. 
No. I can't explain it. Your Spanish doesn't, it's, it's Spanish, but it doesn't sound Spanish. It's different. Yeah, because it's not from the Spanish from Spain. So it's, okay. it's another kind of, yeah. Okay. People say we, we, we talk so a little bit more like, like we sing, no? Yeah. Like we, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Plaja de Carmen. Plaja de Carmen. Yeah, Carmen. everything I just said. Like, Plaja. Yeah. And yeah, here, yeah, Mexicans yeah. say playa. Okay. Tell them about the uh, the Belize and the violence, because that's what a lot of people think that yeah. Belize is crazy and everybody gets shot every day <laughs> and everybody's going to die. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to rob you because you were tourists. And... But the thing is, you have to understand that if you do not yeah, go to right. a certain country, mm -hmm. you only hear about what is being talked about. So yeah. there's no way for you that to say, really, like, oh, well, you know what? You know, but. What's the, is it a country like any other country. It has its good and it has its bad. No country is perfect. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. um, there are some areas where you don't go into because they have their guns there and whatnot. Okay. There are some areas that is, um, and you walk there any time of the day and you're fine. But if a tourist comes and they stay in the city and they're drinking, partying, and, you know, by themselves, all drunk, going there to their hotel at like 3 in the morning, you're asking for some shit to happen to you, you know? Okay. You're begging for it. But if you're mindful and do not act like a tourist, it's some sort of really stupid. Uh -huh. You don't act like a tourist and you, yeah, you know, so. keep her common sense and stuff, then you're good. But yeah, that's not the case. Hour. The only time that you're going to hear about gun violence uh -huh. is pe yeah, in, in, people in their own little thing. Uh, okay. Like this one doesn't like that yeah. one, so hey, you know, because I want to show you that I am bad. Nothing like that. Uh, yeah, that's place. Kind of, that's like it's a nice place. I don't feel great. That's what it we works. Do. Like, we do it definitely Running works. around with little panties, and that's it. That's what it is. Alright, that's cool. I'm that's sure. Cool. Where sure are they from? I mean, I'm. You know, you remind me of about I'm looking at you. Yeah, Naomi Campbell. Some, you was a, for some reason. You remind me of. Yeah, I'm like, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, you remind me of Naomi Campbell. I'm like, what? And I am not high maintenance. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Anything else you want to say on behalf of Belize before I close this interview? We welcome you. And when you come to San Pedro, come to Urban Fair. That's okay. my big okay. shop. Yes. Okay. Let me show. Let's try. I'm going to do everything but the little person because that's not in the States. They get in some trouble for doing that. <laughs> Everybody else cool. I just didn't get the little person because yes, in the so States it's a little problem. Our bit shop here. Okay. And we have... We have a lot of the basics, and we have a lot of good stuff too. Okay. All right. Once again, thank you. No problem. Well, I'm um, telling me about Belize and uh, inform us about Belize. This is Philly Dom. Please get this video a like, and please, please subscribe to my channel, and please come down to Belize because you see they have wonderful, beautiful people here. We don't all look like this. Some of us Whoa. Oh, oh, that's all right. <laughs> Take care. Just say bye to the camera. Bye. Take care. Nice to meet you guys. Andrea from El Salvador. Yes. <laughs> Where are you from in El Salvador? Andrea? I'm from here, from the city, from San Salvador. Okay. What could you say about your city? Um, I love my city. Um, I don't know. I've been here all my life. I was born and raised here. Okay. And I love it. I love my country. Um, I know. I love your country too. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> it means a lot. Um, I know in the around the world we have a really really bad reputation but you know I I talk to people from all around the world every day okay. here and I I always tell them that the media sells like, violence is the thing that sells them more and yeah. our gangs are specialists in that okay and our media focus just on that and that's we Salvadorians we do wrong on that because every time you go into Facebook or Instagram or something uh -huh. someone from your own country has shared a bad news yeah. but no one shares about our art our yeah. culture I our know. history our food oh my god our the food, food is so amazing Thanks. <laughs> I'm in love with your food I, know, I am in love I with know. your food um me too believe me yeah. but so what i try to tell people is just mm -hmm. don't skip el salvador everybody comes to central america everybody mm -hmm. travels around and everybody just skips el salvador because of what they heard on the news or 
because of what a friend told them they heard, but nobody right. comes and actually see it from themselves. So I invite you guys to really come, see it. I promise you, you won't get killed. You won't it's get shot. Promise, you won't get killed. You won't get shot. <laughs> I mean, yes. Um, it's the same in every in every country. We all have bad parts. We all have a, a bad, um, sketchy areas, mm. but. And it's not it's not all of that i mean we really have be some beautiful stuff so in our beautiful people too see i told you guys see that's why i keep doing these interviews <laughs> to let you guys know that it's a beautiful place and it's beautiful people but nobody believes me, so I'm gonna keep doing these interviews. I'm gonna keep pushing these interviews out, and I'm gonna keep doing them so you can understand that every place has their good and their bad. And like she was saying, that people focus on the bad instead of the good. Hey, What's up, guys? I'm here with my friend. What's your name? Uh, my name is Nelson. Nelson. He's from um, El Salvador. Yeah, San Salvador. From, from San Salvador. What's up, brother? Yeah. I wanted to ask you today. I've been traveling through El Salvador. I've been in San Salvador and El Tunca, and a lot of people here speak. Good English, a lot of El Salvadorians. Uh -huh. Why do a lot of El Salvadorians speak good English? Let me know. Man, you know what? It's just struggle is real, and once everybody push comes to shove, everybody's gonna be like, you know what? I need to learn that English, and the only thing making it out here is pretty much knowing English, or else you're not gonna advance your career, basically. You can be a doctor, you can be a psychiatrist, you can be whatever, even a lawyer. But either way, Salvador. if you don't know English here, you're not going nowhere. So English is a big deal out here in El Salvador. Yes, basically. And wow. that's not a lie, that's the truth. Uh -huh. That's why a lot of people speak English here, because in yeah. San Salvador, a lot of people speak good, good English, good English. Yeah, man, uh, because you know, man, once the struggle gets real, they're, of course, they're gonna perfect it. And okay, they have a lot of calls in this year and stuff. I noticed that too, because yeah. I got a friend, a good friend that works at a call center right now too. Oh, really, for real? Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, she cool, does, cool. yeah. My friend, she's like a supervisor over there. Oh, yeah. nice, nice, nice. I mean, okay, so it's maybe a... Maybe hook me up with her because that's what yeah. my, goal, my end goal is going to be pretty soon, so... You need a call for a job? I, 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 I might be managing my own team pretty soon, so next time you... Uh -huh. I give, well, I'll give you my what's up. I'll give you my what's up. Okay. And cool, you can link cool, up cool. with her. You can link up with her and talk cool, to her direct. Cool. That sounds good, man. All right, man. I appreciate you, man. Billy Dawn, man. Yeah. You're the best. You're the best. Hey, yeah. if you're not already subscribing, subscribe to his channel. This guy's the best. He's the truth. He's the real. Subscribe and hit that like button. Yeah, where we at right now? Let them know where we at. Uh, right now, we at a, at a hostel. Basically, this place is like uh, paradise. It's so a cool. whole, like walking steps from El the beach. Look at this. I'm on the lab side right here. It's, yeah. it's a couple walking steps. If you walk out here, uh -huh. you're right at the beach. Right at the beach. So we're getting it. Yeah. We're getting it. My man's grinding right there with the yeah. videos to bring you guys good updates content. every day. Yeah. Good content. Yeah. So subscribe. This guy grinds hard. Thank you. So you guys, man. Keep it real. And you know I gotta ask you the, the elephant in the wall question. I always do this in all the interviews. Yeah, what's but up? Salvador. Is El Salvador really dangerous for tourists? No, no, tourists are no. Metal belt, man. I completely disagree, man. If you guys want to hit up El Salvador and you guys want to come down, especially El Tunco, let me know. I'll show you guys around. But yeah, uh, El Salvador is very safe, honestly. It's very safe. Don't let the media misunderstand what El Salvador is all about. You're going to have great food. If you're into photography, you're gonna go into the mountains, take good photography. Oh my God, the possibilities are endless. Uh, to visit, pretty much, you're gonna be like, going to a whole different country within a country. So, you guys. Don't sleep on El Salvador and give El Salvador. If, if you guys wanna come down to El Salvador, take it down. That's, you know what? It should be on your bucket list, your next bucket list. Thank you for that, man. Yeah. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate yeah, man. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Appreciate you. Yeah. And we're going to close this interview. Peace out from El Salvador. Unless you want to give me an Instagram or something. Uh, I pretty much, I forgot my Instagram. Okay. So no, 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 no problem. Don't worry about it. Peace out from El Salvador.